Hello everyone, this is Amit Dan of AmitDan.com. Today I'll have another episode of SanDisk USB drive video and I'll talk about SanDisk UltraFit USB 3.1 flash drive which I have it right here. If this is your first time or repeat visit, thank you for your support. On this channel, I'm always trying new and different ideas. If you're into thinking outside the box, this is the channel to subscribe. If you're looking for more review videos, there will be links in the description box below. So in the past, I reviewed Sandris, SanDisk Ultralux and SanDisk Ultra Dual USB Drive. And today I have here the SanDisk Ultra Fit, which uh, is kind of like, you know, a little brother of these two. So we're going to take a look at it and we're going to do a testing of the speed. So let's just go over a few of the specs before we start. This is actually 64 gigabyte uh, because I didn't need a lot and the speed is 130 MB uh, per second. Uh, if you remember, uh, these two have actually 150. So this is slightly uh, slower than these two, but it's not a big deal. It's just a little bit. And you can see here that, you know, instant plug and play and transfer a movie less than 30 seconds. Then we have uh, keep private files private with secure access software. So if you use their software, you can actually just like, you know, keep some files private, uh, but I never use those. Uh, and here we have some more information. So we're going to, you know, just uh, open this up. And here looks like, uh, you know, we are supposed to cut right here. So I'm just going to quickly cut it and see if it's easy to take it out. Okay, usually I always have like, you know, problem or trouble opening this type of like, you know, packaging, uh, which is made of plastic and part paper. Uh, so this one, uh, let's just take a look here. Okay, so here looks like, you know, you get a little bit kind of opening and I'll just try to sneak in my fingers and let's see. Okay, so the only the cover came out. And where's the disc? Okay, so looks like you know it got stuck here, as you can see. Just so let's just kind of try to. Okay, so finally we we're able to take it out. I'm just going to put this back in here, and then we'll start with the the review. Okay, so the first thing I'm gonna have to tell you that that uh, this is really tiny. Uh, if you wanna, you know, do the size comparison you can see that how smaller is this and if you're going to do a comparison with this then you can see that you know how tiny is this so this is just really very small and i would prefer actually these two when you travel because this is so small that i think it, you can easily lose it anywhere uh, you know when you're traveling but this would be a very good to you know do some backup when you're at home so for example i'm just going to do my uh usb backup usb drive boot backup for my new uh surface for laptop which i have it right here and if you're interested in a review of surface 4 i'll put a link in the description box below so what i'm going to do i'll just put it into the surface 4 and see you know how uh plug and play it is or if it just picks up right away so let's just uh open up the computer so I'm just going to insert it in surface 4 and okay so you can see that you know uh, the computer picked it up right away so I'll just like you know put it uh, I'll just put it down so you can see So here we have the folder which is showing as USB drive 4 and let's see what I have here. So I have here a 5 gigabyte file and here 19 gig. Okay, so I just need a smaller file to, you know, do the testing. So let me just find something uh, very small. So I have so I have a small file right here which is 557 megabyte and I'm just going to copy here and put it in here and then we'll see like you know how it handles so let's just copy this and let's just paste this here and you can see that it's doing very fast and I'm gonna have to say 
it would take about 10 15 seconds okay so I didn't have actually a timer but it looks like you know it took about 10 seconds so the file size we have here is 550 approximately and the speed is 130 MB per second which is the read speed so when I transferred it looks like it took me about uh, 10 seconds um, could be slightly one or two seconds more but let's say it took 10 seconds so it looks like it took uh, you, the speed you're getting actually is slightly uh, lesser than what it is but again this is read speed and I'm transferring files from one folder to another folder so it may not be exactly the same but you know still I'm gonna have to say that you know this is satisfactory it's not too bad at all this is so small I would mainly use this for purposes where I don't need to take this out uh, I just like you know let's say I'm doing some backup or I'd like to store something and I don't need to you know deal with them uh, with it uh, frequently uh, I wouldn't use it for travel because I think you're gonna lose it very easily for that I think these two are better options so what I'm going to do I'm going to do a backup of my computer and I'm going to you know back up on this for the USB boot drive uh, backup and I'm just going to like you know leave it there because I don't need to use that anymore after that and that's the purpose I bought it but overall the build quality the build quality looks okay uh, this is definitely plastic but it still it feels like you know uh, strong and durable and here you have kind of like you know uh, a space it looks like you can just put it with your kitchen if you want but you know I, I never do that but uh, in terms of the price and everything definitely it's something you know um, you can buy and again all my reviews are non-affiliated unbiased and honest uh, there there's no affiliated links no nothing so you get only you know uh, real and honest opinions so that was the review of the SanDisk Ultra Fit USB 3.1 flash drive and the storage or the one I have is 64 gigabyte so thank you for watching this video there will be more videos coming up so I'll see you shortly thank you